You know something? Skill-based matchmaking really sucks. It really does. It's sad. It's sad to see that all the Call of Duties, the way they are, you know what I mean? Like, skill-based matchmaking is really killing Call of Duty. It's killing it. Um, I grew up playing the old school stuff, man. 360 era. Playing it, man. I wish, hopefully, we might get the other old school Call of Duties on Game Pass. I am willingly to play Call of Duty Infinite Warfare, Ground War Lobby. That's what I'm waiting on, hopefully. Because Call of Duty can't even make a good game. They, they hire retards. It's like they won't bring up skill-based matchmaking. And it's like... It, it's like one of those political lefties, man. They're they're kind of like it, you know what I mean? They won't bring up skill-based matchmaking because it's a, a very controversial topic. I'm like, just remove it because they have a capability to mess with the matchmaking system. So if they remove the darn thing, my gosh, Call of Duty would be so fun. It'd be so popular. Call of Duty be huge on the headline. Oh, they removed skill-based matchmaking. Yeah, it'd be popular. And I hate it how um, they make games in a fictional settings, fictional world. It's it's so freaking funny. Oh, we don't want to thin some people. I want to play as a Russian Spetsnaz, you know what I mean? Like, play as a def default soldier, you know what I mean? Play as a Spetsnaz. Or... Army Rangers or something like that. Delta Force. But no, this is... They're too incompetent. They won't do nothing like that. It's... Pretty sad. Pretty sad. Can't get nothing like this. Cool maps like this. It's like, they pay these streamers to cheat on the game. It's a ruin, man. Ruin big time. I, I hope Elon Musk, like, maybe says something and Call of Duty be like, okay, listen to you, Elon. I'm doing it. Remove skill based matchmaking. Hopefully. It's, it's crazy, man. Think about what's going on with Call of Duty. Black Ops 6, you know, that's going on Game Pass. The, the new MW3 is on Game Pass. But, man, put the rest of the Call of Duties on Game Pass. That'd be great. I feel like they might. I don't know. But, I don't know what's going to happen. I just... Oh, for the goodness, get something good, get something good, but skill based magic banking, if they remove that, man, man, they'd be selling billions, man, they'd be getting rich like Trump, but they have, they hire people by uh, diversity hiring, Call of Duty Activision is in California, the most horrible state right now Call of Duty needs to get out of California and be at a like I don't care if Call of Duty is the headquarters be in Arizona that'd be cool Arizona Texas something like that Florida we would get common sense people you know what I mean that loves video games pretty cool pretty cool now they hire people with pink hair that um, slip their butt cracks and and likes uh, huffing puffing on Joe Biden's leg leg hairs and highly they they are the ones that support Kamala. Like, what the hell, man? Hire people that loves gaming and people that looks like a Walmart. 
woman or person that likes sniffing and supporting Antifa and yeah it's pretty crazy pretty crazy pretty crazy oh man crazy I don't know I just want to get this off my chest man and I am really looking forward to the Modern for 2 OG uh, remastered multiplayer for the PC. Hopefully in the future, my bucket list get myself a nice, decent, a decent gaming PC. I definitely buy Modern Warfare remastered and get that MW2 multiplayer remastered mod. That's my dream. And man, seeing the gameplay looks way better than Black Ops 6. That says something, and um, I guess Activision approved on them doing this mod. So let's see, let's see what happens, and if this uh, gets more people playing that mod, I maybe Activision will turn things around. Who knows? Who knows? It's it's pathetic how. Everything is, and you know, Activision won't make maps like this because, oh, this is Russian propaganda. This just triggers our narrative because we support Ukraine, this and that. I'm like, dude, shut up, make a good map. Something like this, you know what I mean? No, they wouldn't put crosses on those buildings because that triggers them because they care about being satanic and all that stuff they want to indoctrinate children you know what i mean putting the pride flags in the game you know what i mean and they remove russian flags like really so that lazy you care about pronoun flags and tranny flags what the hell is that man you know it's sad just make a game about war and military only like the old school call of duties stop with this stupid operator bullcrap i want to play as the default soldiers or make my soldier just like call of duty ghosts that's simple very simple very very simple That's how I think, man. Uh, hopefully something happens. I don't know. Battlefield used to be good. Halo 3 used to be good. Uh, the Halo series now. 3 for 3 is so retarded. They're so freaking lazy. Like they're taking retard pills. So. That's the way it is. I hope something happens good in the future my lifetime uh, I'm losing my voice man fighting me in the back call of duty man crazy crazy that's the video that's how I do things something to talk about why not that's how I like my tall Belarus chicks Asian women all the way yeah 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 I'm out of here. Also the wall.